How's it going, everybody? Mike here with December 2020 Merch by Amazon Sales Update. Uh, first of all, Happy New Year, everybody. It's a January 1st. I figured I'd get this video out uh, as soon as possible. It's uh, years over and, and, you know, what a year. Uh, I'm looking forward to 2021, especially with uh, merch. And uh, we'll talk about, you know, some of the reasons, but let's get into... Uh, some of these numbers. Uh, so previous month, which would be December, total number of sales, and this is the US market, is 212 for the total amount in royalties uh, of uh, $742.79. Now, of course, this is, like I said, uh, just the US market. Let's look at the total, and the total sales are as you can see here 255 so there's a difference between 212 and 255 and let's look at uh, some of the other marketplaces so uk as you can see here 11 sales germany 22 france italy and then we get into spain nothing in japan yet i i did actually post a few products uh to the Japanese marketplace and this was through uh, Merch Titans because they, they actually have a pretty nice uh, translation, uh, I don't know, function, option, whatever you want to call it. And, uh, you know, I trust it. I, I have no idea if it's accurate or not. Uh, but again, you know, I, I don't know anything about the culture or, or anything like that. So no idea, for example, what would be trendy if, if even the same ideas would apply. Uh, so no sales yet. Anyways, let's let's look at some of this. So, as I was kind of preparing for this uh, video, I was I was looking at, at these numbers specifically, and like I understand it's it's December. I understand it's it's holiday uh, shopping, uh, but these numbers are uh, interesting to me. Uh, you know, f I don't know what the total is. Let's do the math quickly. Ten. Uh, 32 40. so about 45 sales uh, in the Euro European marketplace and, and I actually did the math I uh, I did the uh, actually this isn't it it's over here so the total sales amount for the European marketplace would be 600 and uh, 528 euros which is about 640 uh, dollars but here's the thing this is not including pounds so when it comes to it i'm, I'm doing about uh, let's say 700 dollars in sales uh in the european marketplace and that's pretty good for i mean a lot of people are excluding these marketplaces and then when you add up the the royalties uh, this is a hundred bucks in euros plus um these 33 pounds which is you know i think 40 bucks so, so anyways, basically my point is that I'm still getting a hundred and you know thirty forty dollars uh, in uh, in royalties from the European marketplace, and a lot of people are actually uh, choosing not to post anything uh, to those marketplaces. Anyways, I'm gonna give it a shot until I uh, see a reason not to, and uh, but for now it's uh, it's not looking bad. So here are the numbers. Now, let's look at things that, like I said, uh, I'll compare these sales to the previous months, but and, and then show you one thing that to me is actually extremely exciting. So compared to November, it went down. But again, if you've seen any of my previous videos, you know exactly why. So that's not a surprise. And uh, today, so it's January 1st, and I have nine sales, so seven in the US and then two, I think it one's in uh, Germany and then I can't remember, let me look up the country here. Uh, it looks like it's Italy, uh, but so far so good. And like I said, what is exciting to me is that I'm creeping up to uh, 8,000 sales. So I just hit 7,000 sales, uh, which means that the next uh, tier would be 10,000. Now, a couple days ago, I put out a video and I wasn't actually sure about uh, what the next tier after that is. You know, is there anything between 
10,000 and 20,000? You know, will they bump me up to 12,000 or 15? And somebody responded, and again, I'm trusting you guys, uh, that the next tier after 10,000 is 20,000, which means, and this is the exciting part, you know, I'm kind of thinking forward. It's January 1st, so I'm thinking ahead. Uh, most likely, and this is the worst case scenario, by the end of the year, I will be at a tier uh, 20,000. And fairly soon, uh, you know, I don't, I don't, I don't want to predict anything, but let's say by June for sure, I will be at a tier 10,000. So to me, that's actually uh, extremely exciting. And, and you know, uh, 7,000 sales is, uh, you know, at least pretty good to me. So the sales have kind of hovered. And again, you know, nothing after Christmas is, is crazy, but there were still sales coming in. And one thing that I actually kind of am noticing that ever since I started uh, kind of changing things, and I would say changing things significantly with, uh, you know, deleting products that have been up for sale for a while and not sold, uh, getting rid of uh, some products completely, and then actually starting to list um, new products, meaning like uh, iPhone and Samsung cases and uh, uh, throw pillows and all that kind of stuff. And uh, it's it's paying off. Actually, where was the, I can't remember. I, I saw something. Uh, here it is. So one of the top sellers, and again, not top sellers, but within, uh, the, I would say the top 10, is is an as an iPhone case, and again, you know, this all of these products I've only started listing in the last uh, couple of months, uh, max max. So uh, things are slowly kind of getting to the point where I imagine them, especially with uh, uh, this number creeping up. And uh, I, I've mentioned this last couple of times. Two things that I wanted to do is increase the number of products with sales, and then increase my uh, royalty percentage and where's that number so three dollars and fifty uh, cents in royalties per sale and and this number was actually much closer to two dollars uh, probably six months ago or or something like that so like I said a couple of things are happening uh, new products are starting to sell uh, you know I've had two two months and again this should not be a surprise to anybody, including myself, that, that were over 200 sales uh, a month, uh, November and December. But, but like I said, I'm creeping up to tier 10,000. And then some of these other marketplaces are, you know, selling. I, th these numbers in royalties are not crazy. But again, you know, I'm going to be getting close to $1,000 in sales um outside of the US market which is uh again it's definitely you know not something to to take as as a joke uh and again these numbers hopefully will will grow i can play around with products see for example what sells in which marketplace you know is it t-shirts is it pop sockets and the answer for germany is pop sockets so and again you know it, it's always the question is, is your translation accurate if you don't know german you know how are you getting your translation are you going through uh google translate uh, for me uh, in this case it's it's again merge titans um, tool that i've started using a couple months ago um, so anyways uh, things are okay things I'm, I'm happy with with everything and and how it's going and then uh, i had this screen up but i just wanted to uh, actually, that's the wrong one. I had this screen up, but I just wanted to kind of reflect and, uh, and, and hopefully, uh, January is, is going to go over, uh, the average for the last, you know, six months. Uh, but we'll see, I, I would say I would be happy with anything, uh, you know, <laughs> definitely 200 and plus, but we'll see because naturally, uh, in January sales will will go down anyways uh, things are looking good like I said this is super exciting uh, these numbers are growing this is growing and uh, you know things are looking good it's it's January 1st uh, anyways happy New Year's thanks for watching guys